Well, I think politics at its best is servant leadership, but I don't think politics always works at its best as a servant leaders. And I think that if servant leadership as a principle, as a philosophy of life, were more and more incorporated in uh, national politics, but also in the services of the government, that people would feel that the government as such is truly promoting the highest and best in individuals. I think that's the ideal of our American government and of our American way of life, but I don't think it's always practiced. I deal with a lot of the poor and people who are in any form of uh, disability or people who are in any form of need. Very often they wait in lines and they're just a number and they're not considered as a person. And sometimes the workload given to particular people who serve them is so high that what happens is they, the, the people who come who are the poorest and the least do not feel valued for themselves. And that, so if people were to even study servant leadership, perhaps it would help them to have uh, an inner value which would give them new lights in what they're doing, even in the most difficult work environments or even as the poorest of the poor.